<sighs> oh, we're on. Hang on. Uh, here, I, do you want to touch the glittery ball? Oh, I'd love to. Go, oh, why, why don't you touch the glittery ball? I, oh, oh, can, can you reach it? Oh, I, can you reach I'm it? Trying. Oh, 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 oh. Why do you do this to me? No, I'm kidding. Come on. You're evil. It's a, it's a treat. It's a special. It's our special favorite day of the year. Oh. Yeah, you know what day it is today. Is it? Is it Morgan Freeman's birthday? Morgan Freeman's birthday today. Yeah. Morgan Freeman's birthday. We, so we, every year we celebrate by touching the glittery ball. Ah. Uh, yeah, yeah. And then we always. How do you like to wish Morgan Freeman his birthday? Well, I have a special Morgan Freeman chip. Yeah. All right. Uh, do, do it then. Engage yeah, yeah. the Morgan Freeman chip. Okay. Go ahead. Watch this. Hello. I'd like to say happy birthday to Morgan Freeman. <laughs> hold tight, hold tight, there's more. It's time to get busy living. Yeah. Or get busy opening presents. That's terrible. That, you, you took the, the line from the Shawshank Redemption and uh, instead of saying dying, you said opening presents? Yeah, I'm just reading what it says on the paper. All right. <laughs> No, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. But yeah, I was going to say, wh wh where's the paper? Yeah, that, that's a good question, Craig. <laughs> Is Morgan Freeman really here tonight and hiding behind you? That's the truth, Craig. I am Morgan Freeman. <laughs> you look different from in your movies, Mr. Freeman. Makeup. For the remainder of the show, I will speak in this voice. That's going to be weird. And awesome. Balls. We're right back with Morgan Freeman Jeff. The Late Late Show with Craig Ferguson. Sponsored by... completely real cheering. <laughs> Man, I've never said to an audience, hey, stop, and they went, whoa, stop. <laughs> Finally, boom, done, we're done. Get on with it. <laughs> hey, I've put my pants up a bit high tonight because I tied my short, my tie was a bit short. So I thought, well, I, you know, because my, my pants are usually about here, but then I thought, oh, well, that doesn't look very good, so I've just hiked them up. <laughs> Feels good. It's a real. I can see why grandpas do it. It's awesome. It's like, get off of my lawn. <laughs> it's a great day for America, everybody. Yes, it is. It is. It is a great day. But not a great, uh, not a great day for one American, uh, New York Congressman Anthony Weiner. I. Uh, <laughs> Kind of writes itself, really, doesn't it? I call him Tony Wiener. Not to be confused with Nathan Lane, who's a Tony winner. <laughs> it seems like uh, the uh, Wiener is in a bit of hot water. Uh, now, some... <laughs> Sometimes that's very pleasant, of course, but not this time. Congressman Wiener's uh, Twitter account was hacked, allegedly. <laughs> And someone texted a, a, a picture of his um, junior senator to a college girl. <laughs> now, this is good news for me, because now I can get on the CBS computer and Google Wiener photos at work and not get fired. <laughs> Wiener photos. I'm researching! <laughs> That's right. The CBS computer. The one CBS computer. <laughs> and it's a wang. <laughs> 
and then there's the computer. The uh, Congressman Wiener uh, will not say that the photograph is not of him. He said, though, it may have been digitally manipulated. <laughs> I don't know what he said about the photograph. I can't believe, though, that the media is making such a big deal over this little thing. Well, average size thing. <laughs> well, little thing to me. As you can probably tell by my high pants. <laughs> it's my new thing I'm trying. Eyebrow, will not it? <laughs> uh, today, Donald Trump demanded that congressmen release the long-form wiener. Uh, the... Uh... <laughs> That... Anyway, the congressman thinks that hackers are targeting him because of his last name, you know, Wiener, which is very bad news for Congressman Harry Vagina. Uh... <laughs> A lot of Wieners in the news today. You know, from Andy Wiener, uh, uh, Andy Dick is also in the news. The, uh... yeah. <laughs> No, Andy Dick's being sued. During one of his stand-up comedy shows, apparently he rubbed his naked genitals into a man's face. <laughs> allegedly, allegedly. Now the man wants uh, some money. He's suing him, and I'm like, hey, hey, mister, don't you know how the strip club works? You shouldn't be collecting money. You should pay Andy money. You pay Andy money one dollar a time into his thong. That's how it works. It's good to hear that Andy's working, though. I'm always happy to see him doing his thing. Over the Memorial Day uh, weekend. Did you have a nice Memorial Day, by the way, Jeff? Yeah, I did. Yeah? What'd you do? I ate wieners. I liked your pause there that before you said wieners. I ate wieners like that. It was almost as if you were expressing something with your face, and then I went, oh, no. Yeah. I know. What was I talking about? Memorial Day, yeah, over the weekend, there was a big hullabaloo at the Great Pyramids in Egypt. So it's, 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 it's a scientist. I'm turning into p -p Porky Pig. Did you notice that? Yeah, you s s certainly are. Ah, yeah, it's, 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 what, 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 why I am? That was weird. Yeah. Anyway, scientists... <laughs> Scientists are using a robot explorer at the pyramids. Yes, you may well go. Because <laughs> they're using this robot explorer to go down and photograph the secret chambers that no human has seen in 4,500 years. In your in pants. In your pants, yeah. <laughs> but the amazing part is there's graffiti down there. It hasn't been translated yet. It probably says Larry King was here or something like that. But... <laughs> But when I heard that they're using a tiny robot camera to explore dark, unexplored passageways, it made me think, oh, I'm nearing the age where I need one of them colonoscopies. <laughs> I'd like to volunteer. No, 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 no. And I'm looking forward to see what the robot explorer might find in the pyramids, because some of these chambers are only eight inches wide. So there's... <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> Shut up! <laughs> Shut up! Oh, yeah. Shut up! <laughs> but why would Egyptians build tunnels too small for humans? That's what I'm thinking. Does this prove the existence of Egyptian leprechauns? <laughs> what do you think, TJ? How the hell should I know? Uh, I like, I like your uh, the snake on a stick there. That's good. Yeah, it is good, huh? Yeah, it's pretty good, yeah. That just, no, 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 no. Get, get You're overacting. Get off. Uh, later, Jeff. He's overacting again. You see him overacting there, Jeff? It was unbelievable. It, really? I mean, he's only meant to come on and do his line. He came on, he started chatting. He was putting his snake in your cup there. Sounds good to me. Yeah. <laughs> anyway, we're talking about the Great Pyramids. They're, they're truly spectacular. We have a picture of the Great Pyramid. <laughs> so, no, that's the one in Vegas. That's, that's actually better than the one in Egypt because it has carrot tops six nights a week. <laughs> if the ancient Egyptians could have seen the carrot top show, they'd have been like, that flame haired serpent man cracks me up. He's funnier than I thought, but he's good, isn't he? Carrot well, he's top. great. Yeah, yeah. 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 <laughs> I, I, I have him six nights a week, too. <laughs> Wait, wait, wait. Did you just ooh the robot? <laughs> they ooed you. So rude. I know. Don't come here and ooh my robot. I 
I don't ooh your appliances. I don't come out of your house and go, ooh, blender, ooh, ooh, vacuum cleaner with the proper amount of suction, ooh. Make that noise again. Ooh. You like it? Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. This is Ooh. getting weird. Uh, all right, you know what time it is anyway. Oh, yeah, yeah. We'll be right back with more classy comedy and engaging interviews. Plus, the Late Late Show. <laughs> I see what you did. Yeah, it was yeah, yeah, that was, yeah, that was, that was yeah. pretty funny, yeah. With a better audience, that would have worked, I think. Yeah. yeah. How about this? What? Bulls. <laughs> yep, that's the one. Yep. Yep. We'll be right back, everybody. We'll be right back. Welcome back, everybody. Welcome back to the show where glittery balls are on display. And Jeff sometimes talks like Morgan Freeman, but not always. Because remember, you at the beginning of the show, you said you were going to talk like Morgan Freeman. Then during the monologue, you didn't talk like Morgan Freeman at all. <laughs> In your pants. Ah, I see. <laughs> so are you going to be talking like Morgan Freeman or Jeff? No, I will be speaking as Morgan Freeman. All right, then, fair enough. <laughs> what time is it, uh, Morgan Freeman? I've got a fever, and the prescription is more tweets. <laughs> Plus the emails, email time again. All right, this is uh, this is from uh, Stephen in Bismarck, North Dakota. Uh, you ever been to Bismarck, North Dakota? Oh hell yeah, I got a place up there. Yeah, you got a place? You got a place in Bismarck, North Dakota? I sure do. Well, Bismarck, what, North Dakota. What do you do there when you go to Bismarck? Oh, Where? I like to go swimming and throw beads, <laughs> things of that nature. Is, is swimming and throw beads? Sure, you should come up sometime. Ah, uh, I probably should. That'd be nice. Where'd you go swimming in Bismarck then? Oh, there's a small lake somewhere in the woods. <laughs> We could take our clothes off and enjoy a beverage and then go swimming after that. <laughs> <laughs> All right, then. We'll do that later, then. <laughs> All In right. your pants. <laughs> this is from Stephen in Bismarck, North Dakota. He says, uh, hey, Craig, my wife wants to hang with the guys on game nights, but she doesn't care or know anything about baseball at all. How do I kindly tell her no? Well, that's one for you, Jeff, clearly. You, you, you know how to deal with the lady. Um, did she say game night or gay night? Yeah, gay night. Yeah, you probably don't want your, your wife hanging around on gay night because she's going she's gonna to feel awkward when you and your buddies are um, doing your, your thing. Uh, this is from uh, Ray in Burbank, California. You ever been to Burbank there? Jeff. Oh, he, oh, forget it. All right. Uh, Rain Burbank says, uh, Craig, I'm trying to think of a good Father's Day gift for my dad. He's about your age. Any suggestions? Ooh. Something with Jeff. Something with me? <laughs> That's not a bad gift idea. Yeah, yeah. Get, get your dad a robot that speaks like a, a very well-respected American movie actor. <laughs> Yeah, just send me over to your dad's place. Yeah. I don't have anything going on. Yeah. Don't send him over on gay night, though. <laughs> this is from Anita in Berlin, Germany. No, oh, Germany! You, you've never been there, have you? Oh, hell, I got a place over there. <laughs> in Berlin? Yeah, of course. What, what, do, you, I do? what do you do? What do you do in Berlin? Well, I like to go swimming and throw... <laughs> Come over yeah, yeah, I suppose I should, yeah. All right, I have to say this in a German accent because it's from Germany. It says, hey, Craig, on a first date, should a woman dress conservatively or provocatively? Provocatively. 
This is uh, from Max in Stratford in the UK. Wait, is anybody in America? Oh, well, I guess Bismarck, North Dakota is in America. <laughs> Stratford in the UK. Ever been to Stratford in the UK? I think once I met a man there. <laughs> what was his name? His name was Jimmy. <laughs> it's back when I was in burlesque. <laughs> What did you do when you were in burlesque then? What, what kind of stuff did you do? Did you well, I was a 300 pound burlesque performer. It's I before the uh, before the accident? Yes, before I died. Yeah, is it? <laughs> well, Max says, uh, Dear Craig, I made a friendly wager with a buddy on a game and won, and then, now he says he doesn't want to pay up. That's pretty cheap, right? Yeah. <laughs> This is from Siena in Tampa, Florida. Ever been to Tampa, Florida? Go to a little place there, go swimming through a pizza. Yeah, exactly. Come on, sometime. No, I get it, I get it, I get it, I get it. Dear Craig, I just found out my best friend is terrified of whole carrots. She saw some in my fridge and flipped out. What does that say about her? She's terrified of orange penises. Now, wait, is it penises or peni? I've never had to use the plural. Jeff, you've used the plural. What is the, is it penises or peni? Well, I remember when I went hunting once for wild, wild peni. <laughs> they like to roam out in, well, you say peni. Yeah, that's what it is. Yeah. Like a group of them, if there's a lot of them. What is the, <laughs> what is the collective noun for penises then? If you get a herd of elephants, what is it? A something of penises, a what, a what of penises? A, a, uh, An Elton John of penises, oh is it? Oh my God! A, a, penal, a, a pickle of <laughs> hell if I know. Uh, uh, this is from somebody, and uh, so is this, and uh, well, they're, they're all there. We got them done. Well done, everybody. We'll be right back. <laughs> Morgan Freeman Birthday Spectacular, where tonight my first guest is a superstar athlete, one of the most famous athletes in the world. He's Major League Soccer uh, at the Los Angeles Galaxy. Take a look at this. David Beckham, everybody! You're so nice and well dressed. Look at you, you're gorgeous with your thing. And <laughs> Thank you're, you, very you're, much. you are a bit of a dandy. It's, it's very impressive. It's well, good. I'm English. This is how we dress. Well, I've been to England this and not all of you dress like that. <laughs> Some of these men were wearing tank tops in the club I was in. Well, <laughs> well this is how my mom told me to dress. Well, it's, you look very nice. No, I like it. You're very put together and you smell very nice as Thank well you. for an athlete. Thank you. Is that your own fragrance? Do yes, you? it is. Is it really? Fragrance, yes. And I have a new one coming out very soon. Hence your appearance on this <laughs> show, <laughs> I would imagine. No, nothing to do with that. Really? What's nothing. your fragrance called then? Instinct. Oh, can I have a sniff? Yes. Right. <laughs> it's nice. It's nice, right? <laughs> You're okay with that, aren't you? You're okay with being smelling Sniff, nice. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I like being. Do you like men coming up and sniffing you? Love it. <laughs> Love it. You're in the right game then, really, <laughs> aren't you? Were you watching? Were you watching the Barcelona Manchester United? Then? Yes. Yeah. Unfortunately. Yeah. That. That. Well, there you go. Unfortunately. Yeah. Well, I'm a huge Manchester United fan, but. Well, you played uh, there long enough. Didn't I played you? there for almost 12 years, so, um, you know, my heart's still there. It was the club that I always wanted to play for, but yeah. uh, you know, they came up against such a great team with Barcelona. So yeah. Was, well, uh, them Spanish can play a bit of football. They know. can. Yeah, they yeah. can. They've got some great players. Yeah. So. Yeah. You were at Real Madrid as well, weren't you? Yeah, I was there for four years. So. Do you enjoy paella? I love it. Yeah, it's nice, isn't I it? Love. I like paella. I yeah. loved. I loved everything about Spain. Yo, admit. Spain's a great place. I like Spain. Yeah, paella was nice. And then, the, what's the name of that wine they drank? Wine. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I like that. Yeah, I had a nice time. Did you ever go to a bullfight? Um, no. No, you're right. Neither because was I. Because I wasn't sure I agreed with everything. No, I, I don't. I, no, I don't like to see 
that. <laughs> I went to one once, though. I went to, Bar uh, not Barcelona, uh, Pamplona. Mm -hmm. I went up there and ran with the Bulls. Did you ever do that? No. No, I'm not. I'm not actually that quick, so I'd worry I'm about it. Oh, stop it! You know you're not, not that. I'm, trust me, I'm not. Well, the thing is, as well, you don't want to get your legs near a, a bull running. Not really. No, not that's... Not really. I'm not sure the managers would be... No, that, they wouldn't like that at all. <laughs> when you were at Manchester United, mm -hmm. Alex Ferguson was there. Yes. And uh, my name's Ferguson, but I'm not really related to him. Oh, really? So you, you and I can alike. be friends. We do look alike. Yeah, we do. We're related through being Scottish and hating things. <laughs> <laughs> Mainly the we, English. Well, no, I no, I'm joking. No, no, I don't, I, I, I don't hate the English. I think Alex Ferguson hates no, the English. No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. <laughs> he hates the Spanish right now, but... Uh, <laughs> <laughs> or some of them. No, he's such a great manager, you know, best manager in soccer, to be honest. And uh, He's pretty you know, good, His yeah. record over the years is incredible and untouchable. Did you ever see footage of him when he was a player? He used to play, I think, for Aberdeen in Scotland and, and uh, Rangers. He and always that. said he was a great goal scorer, but yeah, uh, yeah. I'm not so sure. Yeah, he's, he's, <laughs> he was scoring goals before they were, goals were being filmed, yeah. so you have to take his word for it. That's true. The, That's uh, very true. Oh, well, look, I can see your tattoo there. Yes. Nice. I know, you've got a few. Oh, I've got a couple, yeah, but you've got, you've got the sleeve, haven't you? You've got the full I've sleeve? I've got two full sleeves. Yeah, really? Which my mum's not too happy about. But, uh, <laughs> Come on, you're David Beckham. We don't have to ask your mum for a tattoo now. Yeah, okay. uh, well, she still, every time I have a tattoo, she's like, oh, my God, not another one. Really? I'm going to get some more from it, but have you got uh, anything down that low? Yeah, uh, that's as low as I've Yeah, got. see, that's as low as you want to go. Yeah. Don't go further than that. Don't go this far down. It's bad. I saw the great spirit. <laughs> You know that it's going to hurt <laughs> when the rest of the guys in the tattoo parlor well, come really low. Yeah, it's really low. That's what I'm saying. You do smell nice, David. I have to tell you. <laughs> it's, it's, <laughs> it's very low. I, what did you get your tattoos for? What, 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 what did they uh, um, signify? Every one that I've got on me uh, means something. You How know, many have you everything got? Everything has a meaning. I've got like almost 30, I think. 30 really? 31, yeah. That's a bit too much. I know. <laughs> I know. Have you got any on your business? Um, not yet. I, I was thinking of getting a tattoo on mine. Really? Yeah, let's go together. Okay. Sounds great. Let's go together. Uh, you to. wear your cologne, I'll wear my <laughs> cologne, and we'll, well, I don't have a cologne yet, what but I'm going to get have? We have to think of ideas, though. Well, well, well I'm going to get tattooed on Yeah. I? Well, what are you getting tattooed on yours? <laughs> well, I... <laughs> I thought uh, what I would get tattooed on mine was, uh, Hi, my name is Craig. Very nice to meet you. Have a nice day. Perfect. I'll think of mine. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> well, I'll, I'll, or I'll just get, you know, CF. <laughs> yeah, Depending you should on, get that. Yeah, no. I don't know. I think it would hurt a bit too much. Uh, yeah. You really yeah, have yeah, thought about it. Maybe. You really have thought about it, I kind of was thinking about really? it. Really? Really? Yeah. No, I don't think I could do it. Maybe on my bum, but not on my, uh, not on my junk. But you no. never know. You never know. What do you mean you never? Well, I, whoever put the tattoo on me, I don't want, his name's Doug. I don't want Doug <laughs> messing around my junk with a, 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 a painful pen. Yeah, I'm, I'm not sure I'd want mine messing yeah. around mine either. No, you don't, you don't want to do it. Plus, you know, if he had one slip, he could throw you out for a couple of games. <laughs> yeah. Did you have... <laughs> I do like them though. I, you, you have to have an odd number, do you know that, or it's bad luck? I know, I heard that today. Yeah, I just made it up. I know. Yeah. <laughs> I'd never heard it up until this morning. It, it was told to me by a tattoo artist when he knew I had an even number of tattoos. <laughs> <laughs> Would you let your kids get tattoos? You've got boys. Would you let them get it done? Um, at a certain age, I think, if they wanted to. But, what age uh, is your oldest? He's my oldest is 12. We've got an eight year old, six year old, and a little girl on the way in six weeks. So. Yeah. 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 I've heard that before, but chances are you won't look so great when you're 75. That's either, true. So I'll smell good, though. Yeah, you will smell okay. awesome. I'm yeah. going to smell great. You will. And that's the thing you've got to work out as you get older, because as you get older, apparently, you start smelling like vitamins and wee-wee. 
Really? Which is coincidentally the name of my cologne. Uh, it's going to be vitamins and weaving. Now, do you enjoy uh, living in the United States? Are you having a nice time? I love it. You know, we've lived here for five years now. Yeah, it's, it's been now. incredible. Everyone's welcomed us in so well. You know, not just obviously around, you know, the soccer side of things. But, right. You know, around us living here. So, you know, the boys love going to school here. My, my wife loves working here. So, yeah. what's not to love about living in LA? Well, there's a lot of. Ay, caramba! Dear Dale. <laughs> One, I don't know if one you, or two. Yeah, or I two. mean, to be fair, the, you know, per square foot, there's more douchebags here than anywhere else, really, <laughs> on planet Earth. I I've, mean, I've met one or two. Yeah, maybe. one or two. But I, do you know what, who I did meet? Who's amazing? I met the president the other day, which no way. I, I really wanted. He was to. here. Um, no, in London. Oh. In London, oh, I was invited to a dinner with the Queen and the president and the first lady. And What's that coming to go? <laughs> <laughs> the Queen and the president. Are yeah. You, and, what? Uh, you know, that's the, fantastic. The Look soccer player sat with the Queen and the President. It that's great. Though, I think that's so, very nice. A man that I really wanted to meet. Did the Queen uh, smoke her pipe when you were there? <laughs> no, but funnily enough, she knew that I was having a baby in six weeks. Oh, my wife's having a baby. Of course. Yeah. <laughs> well, she's the Queen. She knows everything. <laughs> she has it, an all seeing eye. It, sho it shocked Ooh. me that she knew. So. No, but she probably read well, I love the, the Queen. The Queen's, you know, to us English, it's, and to everyone, I think, in the world, especially. Yeah, Especially right. over here, I think people well, love Well, they do like it here. Yeah, no, they do Queen that. and the royal family. I wasn't such a big fan of the royal family. And then I watched uh, uh, Prince William get married to Kiki. I know Kiki. what you're going to say. No, no, no. I, okay. what? what, Kiki Wigglesworth? No, go, no, what? go, go. No, no, no. I'm no, I watched it and I thought, they were quite nice. Amazing. They're amazing. Yeah, no, people. I thought, I thought. Amazing. Like, it made me think, oh, good luck, young people, I thought. Yeah. They, they melted my cold Scottish heart. They you know, did. you know why it was so amazing? Because, you know, Prince William and Prince Harry, we've seen them grow up. Up, you know into real men sure. um, and they've gone through so much in such a short space of time yeah. in such you know their yet their young lives and to see you know Prince William get married and Prince Harry still cracking jokes did you uh, was, did you uh, cry at the wedding when you were there it was emotional I didn't cry cuz I'm did, emotional, you cried but I do it. cry at yeah things. do you really yeah I'm an emotional man <laughs> at times at t <laughs> Thank you. At, at times, at that times. That was from lesbian wrong. That, that is the power. Thank you. Man, not only have you melted my cold Scottish heart, that you've melted <laughs> the cold hearts of the grumpy lesbians of lesbian wrong. <laughs> David, we're out of time. Would you like a, an awkward pause, a mouth organ, or touch my glittery ball? I'd love to touch your ball. Touch my ball. All right. Um, let's do it awkwardly. Okay. <laughs> Awkwardly, okay. David, awkwardly. Okay. Don't go rushing in there. It's not a soccer ball, it's a glittery ball. Okay, okay. It doesn't need to be put in the net just right. yet. Take your time. Am I allowed to touch it now? Yeah, you can touch it now. You sure? One hand or two? <laughs> oh! Get him back, everybody! Birthday spectacular, everybody. You were a bit quiet when David Beckham was here. Were you a bit starstruck? I was so excited. Yeah. <laughs> you were like, you didn't say a thing. I've never seen you do that. You were like, ugh, the whole time. Oh, he smells so good. He does smell good, doesn't he? Yeah, I was going to tell him about my new cologne. Oh, yeah, what's it called? Take a guess. Bone, Bone alone. Cologne. Bone yeah, cologne. <laughs> Bingo. Yeah, 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 I'm getting on. Now, look, my next guest has got Emmy buzz for a What does that mean? I mean she's, they're going to give her an Emmy, but we can't say it yet. They're going to give her an Emmy, but we can't say it yet. Uh, it's for her appearance on House and for uh, Law and Order SVU. Take a look at this. What? <laughs> Please welcome Shari Agdashlu, everybody. Shari Agdashlu.
Hello, my dear. Lovely to see you. Lovely to see you, Aye, too. It's lovely to hear you, too. Oh, likewise. Thank you so much. Before we go further, yes. a dear friend of mine, a childhood friend of mine who still lives in Tehran, Iran, yes. send uh, her love. Oh. Uh, send me an email saying that I heard you're on uh, his show. Yes. Uh, and I want, we're going to TiVo it. And I want you to tell him that he is the best and I love him. Well, her name is Marjan from Tehran, Iran. What's her name? Marjan. Marjan? Hi. <laughs> I'm glad. Does she talk like you? She's beautiful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's yeah. beautiful. Yes, I know. <laughs> <laughs> Can I say that even although David Beckham does smell lovely, and he does, I don't know if you met him. But uh, yes, I, I did have but, a chance. To but uh, you smell fantastic. Thank you. I mean, really, it's it... the moment I was watching it. The yeah. moment you sniffed him, I thought, I, I have to do this. What? So I went on and put some nice. Well, well may I sniff you? <laughs> It's not working. Let me try one more. Yeah. I might have to go a little closer. By all means. All right. Oh. <laughs> no, it's very, very nice. It's very, <laughs> Thank you. it's very nice. No, you've got the Emmy buzz going on for for. Now that means they're going to give you an Emmy, but they gave you an not Emmy. Not necessarily. Uh, yeah, not given me one, and I'm still appreciative of it. And it was such a moment, delicious. Yeah. There's nothing more delicious but S slow down. Being just slow down. Yeah. Just say delicious again. Delicious. Yeah. There's nothing more delicious but um, you know by being uh, honored. Honored. Absolutely. By your, by your, by and your, voted by your own peers. By your own peers. By yes. Own they, peers. That's what they always say at the Oscars. I've never had the opportunity to say it myself, but I'm sure it's a lovely thing to say. Thank you. <laughs> Who did you thank when you were up there? Well, uh, it's usually, you know, formal. Um, your agent, your right, manager, right. your people who have helped you to get there. Then you fire them the next day, right? That's the Hollywood <laughs> way. You, you thank them. It all them depends. It all depends. Right. Whether you're just uh, pretending that you're uh, thanking them or you're really thanking them. Well, and you really you, mean what, it. What were you doing? Were I you really doing? meant it. I love people whom I work with. So, really? Yeah. Each and every one Can, of them. May I meet them? By all means. Yeah. No, that'd be nice. Now, the reason is that I do believe life is very Chekhovian. Oh, okay. The people are innocent, and yet at the same time, they could be blamed for their wrongdoings. So I decide to like them before I hate them. So you think then the, uh, the innocent or guilt of the, uh, forgive the expression, douchebags of Hollywood is a, <laughs> is a matter of perception rather than actual guilt or innocence? Well, it could be, absolutely. One has to be really careful not to get confused in here. Well, I was very, very cold and bitter until David turned up and melted my cold Scottish <laughs> heart. And, and then you turned up with your amazing perfume and your lovely brooch oh, here as well. You. That's how it is. And, and all the other you things have such going great on. Taste. Yes. Of course, a handsome gentleman like yourself can. I feel we should smell. throw to a commercial break and get the hell out of here, to be honest. <laughs> <laughs> now, listen, uh, do, you, do you go back to uh, Tehran often? Have you been back there? No, I'm afraid no, you, not. You, you no, can't. That's right. Yeah, 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 yeah. There's a bit of, uh, bit of bother over there. Yes, yeah. Just a little bit. Well, a little bit. Annoying, yeah. yeah. Yeah, but you you uh, you live in Orange County, is that right? No, I live in LA. Oh, I thought you lived down in Orange County. Oh no, oh, I. So live you're actually closer than that. Much closer, yes. Oh, uh, that's good. Actually, Calabasas. I've got a little one running around right now, you know. I heard so. Yeah, four and yeah. a half months. Four and a half months. Oh. Yeah. He's he's a noisy little spud. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> You've got one one daughter. Aren't you? Yes, she is now uh, going to Chapman University. Really? She's a big girl now. Yeah, you must be very proud. Before you know, time flies. Yeah, no. One bling, you turn around and they're taller than you, and they tell you what to do, what not to do. <laughs> well, this sounds awful, actually. Yeah, yeah, and if you don't do it, they say I hate you. Yeah, yeah, I know. First I... time I heard it, I took it so seriously. Yeah. I was really offended. I'm like, really? You really do hate you me. You really do hate yeah, me, no. Mom. Just you know, it's an expression. Just yeah. Expression. yeah. <laughs> So what is she studying then? She's stu studying filmmaking. She wants to be a director. Oh, right. Then she'll really tell you what to do then, won't she? Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. At her disposal. Yeah, no, that's <laughs> you know, All nice. my life. Did you ever fancy that, directing films? Never, no. To be honest with you, no. No, I'd rather be on camera than behind the camera. I find that refreshingly honest. <laughs> I'm rather fond of you, as you know. The feeling is mutual. You I know, know, I know. <laughs> I become aware of a certain chemistry between us. <laughs> <laughs>
Oh, I don't know. So, um, so there you are then. Well, that's nice. Yeah. Do you still have your dogs? My dogs, yeah, 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 all three of them. You got any? Yes, no, not now. I did have uh, three. One in Iran, one in England, and one here. All German Shepherds. Oh, I've got a German Shepherd. I yeah. love German Yeah, no, I, I've got... They're so smart, aren't they? Yeah, they're, well, not that smart. Do you talk to uh, him? Well, I do talk to him, yes. I, he I understands, mean, right? Yes, he kind of does, actually. Does yeah. he cry sometimes? Do you feel him, like, crying? <laughs> yeah, actually, yeah, a little bit, yeah. yeah. I, uh, he, I mean, he kind of... Uh, but do you know what he's saying? No. Maybe others don't. Well, well, kind of. Yeah, I suppose I do. But I've also, uh, the, the, really, my attention is mostly taken up by my French bulldog, who's a very farty, whiny little bastard. <laughs> and what did you call him? What would you? Uh, uh, well, it's a she. It's a cabbage. <laughs> well, it wasn't me. It called my what son. My son called her cabbage me. because it's she smelled like a cabbage. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> yeah. But have you ever danced with your dog? Danced with my dog? Uh -huh. Why, madam, I never have. I have. Well, how do you dance with a dog? Tango put his paws on my shoulder and moved one to the right, one to the left. And he loved dancing, the one in Iran, loved dancing to the Adagio by Albinoni. You've lived a, <laughs> a very different life to me. Indeed. Tangoing with German Shepherd dogs yes. in Iran while I'm stuck here telling you. jokes to an appliance. <laughs> We're out of time already. We're out of time already. That's it. Are we? Yeah. Oh. So uh, it only remains for me to say, um, mouth organ. Um, <laughs> uh, mouth organ, awkward pause, or um, glittery ball. Well, awkward pause. Okay, well, let's do. Awkward pause with restrained sexual subtext. I kind of give you a fright when I turned up that close. <laughs> Sharia Dushley, everybody, we were out. If you're going to be in the L.A. area and would like to attend a taping of The Late Late Show with Craig Ferguson, please call 323-570-0059. You get back here quick from your head being up that cad's ass. Yes, I most certainly did. Yeah. Well, uh, what did we learn on the show tonight? We learned that you get a bit quiet around David Beckham. Well, that's because David Beckham has soccer balls. <laughs> and I like soccer balls. Trouble with soccer balls is though you're not allowed to touch them with your hands. <laughs> That's all right. See? Not like football, where you can touch it with your hands. That's a good point, Craig. Yeah. We also learned that it's possible to dance the merengue with a dog. She's pretty sexy, isn't she? She is on fire. Yeah. Good night, everybody. Good night.